Hi guys, Shaquita here from Crown Me Quita and welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be getting into my summer skincare routine right after this intro. <music> To reiterate, what I do to my skin in the summer differs from what I do to my skin in the winter. Um, we are transitioning into fall, but it's still quite warm outside, so I'm still doing my summer skincare routine. So let's get into these products. But before we get into these products, quick little piece of information. You know with your girl, Frugality is key. And so I love to save a coin wherever I can. So I want to put you on so you can save a coin too. Whenever there is a name brand product that I want to use, chances are whatever store you're buying that product from, they have the store brand. So I like to compare the store brand, the name brand with the store brand um, to match up the ingredients. And in most cases, it will say, um, like you can see here, it says compare to Cetaphil. Y'all, the ingredients in this Equate Beauty brand are almost the exact same as the ingredients in Cetaphil. When I buy Cetaphil, I'm just paying for the name brand. So my daughter likes to use Cetaphil and I use Equate Beauty. And in that, we get to compare our results. And my results look just as good as hers with the store brand. So I'm gonna choose to save a coin. So to reiterate, recap, Whatever store you go to, whatever name brand that you are choosing to buy, check if you want to save some money, check that store for the store brand. In most cases, it's going to say, compare to Cetaphil, compare to CeraVe, compare to whatever. Compare those ingredients. And honey, if they match, go ahead and save you a coin. I saved, I paid half the price for my products versus what I paid for my daughter's name brand Cetaphil products. Also, my store brand products are paraben free. My daughter's C to feel bottle does not say that. Okay, so let's get into this routine. So I've already took the liberty of tying my hair back, as you can see, and I do have on clothes. Got on my workout outfit, just to let y'all know. I'm gonna start by wetting my face with lukewarm water. You never wanna wash your face in hot water. And then I'm gonna go in after my face is wet and apply my gentle skin cleanser. In the summer months, my skin is super oily. Um, and so I need something to gently cleanse, but at the same time maintain the moisture. Um, it's oily, but then I also have dry patches like in the corners of my nose right here and sometimes in my eyebrows. And you can see now like I just woke up. I woke up like this. I woke up like this. Okay, no, let me stop playing. But I just woke up so you can see the oil in my skin like so I'm gonna get that right. I'm gonna get that right, okay? Remember when you are applying your cleanser or any products on your face, it's going an upward circular motion. And it just goes against the direction of gravity to help fight wrinkles. And remember, whatever you do to your face, you need to do to your neck, okay? And I normally rub my cleanser into my skin for a good minute. Then I'm ready to rinse with lukewarm water. But after I rinse my face, I like to just pat dry. If I do this, when I do this at night, I do it in the shower and I let it air dry. But in the morning, I'm typically pressing for time, so I'll pat dry with my washcloth. Once it's dry, I'm going to follow up with one pump of my gentle cleanser. Again, applying that to my face and neck in an upward circular motion until it is completely rubbed in. As you can see, and you don't even really need a full pump. Like, this might be too much. I try to do like a half of a pump. Um, but you may notice that what I do to my skin in summertime is very minimal compared to what I do to it in the winter time. Winter time, my skin is dry. And you just keep rubbing until you know that it's rubbed in completely. When I get near my eyes, I go in a motion like this and then kind of pat it into my eyelids and here to fight crow's lines. Your neck, you're supposed to rub down. I just learned this, I was, um, I learned this last year that when you're moisturizing your neck to go in a downward motion. I don't know. I really don't know, guys. I just try to go against gravity when I am applying my facial. You learn so many things from different people. Adapt. Take what you need. Eat the fish and leave the bones. Take what you need from what you learn from other people and leave what 
doesn't really apply to you or doesn't help you. Like my skin, I'm 35 and it looks very youthful. So I must be doing something right. You know what I'm saying? So just about eating the fish and leaving the bones. If anything I'm saying in this video does not resonate with you, honey, move on. Leave it alone. Okay. This is what works for me. So you have to get to know your skin and what works for you. It is very important to exfoliate. Again, I exfoliate with um, Equate Beauty Oil-Free Acne Scrub, and I, I exfoliate once a week, um, typically on Sunday, because Sunday is, for me, Sunday is self-care Sunday. So I exfoliate my face. I even exfoliate my body with the body exfoliating scrub. Um, but yeah, and this, it only takes like a pea-sized pot. I wet my face and then rub that in, and then I scrub it with my little exfoliating pad that I got from the Dollar Tree. Yes, don't sleep on the Dollar Tree, okay? That's my skincare routine. I don't change my routine as soon as we transition into fall. I pay attention to what it feels like outside. Um, if it's still warm and my skin is still oily, then I stick with my summer skincare routine. When it starts getting cold and I realize that my skin okay is now really dry, I switch over to my winter routine, which I have already recorded for you to look back at. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and adjust your crowns because royalty looks good on you. I'll see you in the next video. Happy YouTubing. Bye. And let me add that I stick with, with those products until I realize based on what my skin is telling me that it's no longer working for me. So this is what I'll use for my summer routine until my skin says, ah, no more, sis. No more. Perks. Okay, bye.